This looks like fun! That was a nice little break. Watch my back! It's me! Do you recognize me? Who's Cypher? I thought that was Eifried! I'm pretty sure Cypher was one of Eifried's officers. Patty! Looks like we don't have time to chit-chat. Cypher, we're settling this here and now! Oh, 
the world is that? We should try to get some answers. I can do even better than this. I'm even stronger now. Ooh, that's nice. my memories and it took me a while but I finally made it back I knew it she's regained her memories I freed <gasps> that's I freed it is you been a while why is he calling her I freed wait a second I freed is me. W what are you talking about? Cypher, you recognize me? Yes. But you must leave this place before I lose myself and turn on you once more. I will not. I came here to release you from that monstrous form and from the Black Hope's fate. That day, I turned my hand against many. Committed a great sin. Is he talking about the Black Hope Massacre? They would have only suffered more if you hadn't. Like the way you're suffering now. That accident turned them all into monsters. And you saved them! And yet the one who killed them lives freely in this form. You saved me. You let me escape. This time, it's my turn to save you, Cypher. I freed. You'd release me from this agony. You've done so much for me, protecting those scallywags in Siren's Harbor. And you've always supported me. But... And now... It ends. <laughs> Patty. Cypher, you're the only one I... I am sorry to make you suffer so, Eifried. I'm far from the only one who suffered. You've been through so much worse, Cypher. You're my friend, so I'll shoulder your pain too. And to free you from your misery, I will kill you. Those people, they are the ones helping you through this. Good. Even without your memories, you are not alone. You are not in pain. That was all I was worried about. You've made some wonderful friends, Eifried. Here, take this. Gemma. Now I can die in peace. Go on. Do it. Cypher. It's okay to cry if you want to cry, you know. No matter how tough the situation is, crying gets you nowhere. That's my motto. Patty. 
I won't cry. Shedding tears is no way to pay my respects to the dear friends I've lost. I am Eifried, boss of Siren's Fang. So I... I will not cry. I will never cry. I don't want to cry. <laughs> Morning, little Miss Crybaby. So, feeling any better after that nice long cry? Uh, I'm perfectly fine. Good. So, now what are you planning on doing? Yeah, now that you got your memories back and you saw what you wanted to see. It's obvious, isn't it? I'm sticking with you guys. Are you sure that's what you want? I. it's not like I'd just abandon you to fight the Autofagos without me. Besides, I've come this far. I want to see it through till the very end. Well, we're glad to have you, Patty. Glad to be here. Um, there's a lot that I've been wanting to ask, but don't know how. Well, I know we're all dying of curiosity, but you tell us when you're ready. I, I'll tell you everything when the time is right. But... What?! Judy, what happened? Wait, that's where Ospio is. What's going on? What happened to Ospio? What the hell is that thing? It looks like a mountain. Belay that. A building. Tarkaron. Huh? The spirits are telling me that's the Tower of Tarkaron. Duke, it's gotta be him. He's going to try to use that against the Autophagos. Please, let me through! You, with the long black hair! Do you have a moment? What do you want? Some people with the Knights wanted me to tell them if I saw someone with your appearance. They said they wanted to talk to you about Flynn, the new Commandant of the Imperial Knights. What? I believe you are the right person. Yeah. Hey, was it a girl with kinda cat-looking eyes and a kid with a head like an apple? Huh? Oh, yes, I suppose so. <sighs> so can I wait at the end? 
Yes, that's fine. I'll call them. So what's up with Flynn? Oh, right. Many people have fled this continent since that monster covered the sky. But some opposed using a guild fleet to protect the Empire. Flynn could not abide that. A fleet attacked by monsters landed on Hypionia. We fought, but they kept gaining. We alone were sent for aid. But all the knights are spread all over the world. We have no other choice but to ask for your help. But we're too late. Commander Flynn must be... Well, could you be any more worthless? What did you say? You give up already? Everything you've done, what was it all for? I... I did it all for Commander Flynn. Even that one time. <laughs> you talk about doing it all for Flynn. You're just whining. You gave up. You forgot your resolve. Resolve? Yo, Applehead. You said Hypionia, right? Y yeah All right. I'll be back soon. All of you get ready to go to Tarkaron. I'm going too. Yeah! Me too! You keep forgetting us! I'm glad you want to come, but this seems pretty bad. That's even more reason not to let you go alone. I don't think Ba'ul will listen to you either. All for the Guild and the Guild for All, right? Well, if we're out of time, let's go and get it over with. I will follow you to the day I die, and with more Moxie than a snapping Moray eel. Okay, okay, so let's get going. Yeah! Brave Vesperia, charge! Go get him! All right, Sodia. Let's reform the support units. Oh, okay. Yuri Lowell. Yuri Lowell! Why? Why didn't you call me out for my actions that time? I... I tried to kill you! Oh, <laughs> I'm not letting it go. But I don't have time to deal with someone who gave up on everything. I haven't given up. No? So why haven't you gone to help Flynn, even alone? You wanted to protect him so badly, you'd kill me! Why won't you protect him now? I... I can't protect him by myself. Please, save him. Please. You don't have to tell me to do that. Please. You know, there's one thing I agree with you on. I'm a criminal. I can be killed any time. Flynn is the perfect knight. A perfect leader. He doesn't need a criminal by his side. Uh. 
I'm just standing in until the right person comes along. Yuri. Flynn always seems to put himself in danger. He's always that way. He doesn't mind getting hurt if it means protecting others. Yeah, he gets a little crazy sometimes. Like you're any different. Birds of a feather, right? I'd say we're all like that. Like what? We all stuck with brave Vesperia, even when the going got rough. <laughs> I guess none of us can just let things go. Right, so we can't just let Flynn go either. Yeah, exactly. Well, since we can't let it go, I think it's time we get a little crazy. Is that it down there? That's some cloud of dust! Are those all monsters? This seems to be a counter-effect of Astal's losing control. It's as if the monsters of the world all came and gathered here. Is Flynn really down there somewhere? Probably. What next? We're gonna fight every single one of them? Fine by me. Just give us two days and we'll beat them all. Probably. Two? You can't be serious! Rita, can't we use that day Nomos you made? You gonna blow them away like doing it to the Atavagos? Right. Applying directivity to the power of spirits and forming a barrier-like force field to eliminate the monsters. Yes, it should be possible. But this was made to be used against the Adifagos, right? But this is our only option now. To use it now or wait till later? This is quite the conundrum. Could you let us use it, please? I beg you to. The day Nomos. I want to believe it can save mankind. Yes, if we can't deal with this easily, there is no way we could stand up against the Adifagos. All right, let's do it. It's rare to hear Yuri ask for a favor like that. It's our chance to do Yuri a favor! Cut it out, guys. So, what's our plan? Activate it in the area where the monsters are all concentrated. That's it. Simple, right? Yeah, it is. No kidding. Why don't we give it a name? 
We can't just call it the Rita de Nomos. Huh? I'll leave it up to you. Uh, hmm. Uh, I got it! How about the Vesperia number one? I should have known better. It's got a nice ring to it. Besides, it's nice and simple. Even Baul will need to keep some distance. I'll land further away. Okay, let's do it. and all over the world, and none of them are true. But adventurers are people who turn legends into reality, right? So what's this paradise like? Who knows? Where is it located? Don't know. Is there anything you do know? Mystery is part of the romance. It's like your magical research, Rita. My research gives clear-cut answers. Don't compare it to your fairy tales. Patty, it's useless trying to explain it to someone like Rita. We will not go easy on you! Luna Go 
so easy on you. Dragon Sword! How power to try soul shot! How Second in command for thinking of you. Sodia? Huh. But our current situation's bad. It's only a matter of time until we fall. We have a little special something. What? Light this thing up in the middle of the monsters? And then watch it go BOOM! In the middle of the monsters, there are a lot to get through. Come on, it's us! This is nothing! <laughs> Alright, let's- Hey, we're gonna go turn this thing on. Keep things going here. Just you two? Are you stupid? We cannot let our guard down here. If we can't defend this place, we lose the very reason for taking out the monsters. This isn't to defeat the monsters. This is to protect the people. That's right. Understood. Leave it to us. We'll do everything we can. Much obliged. Take care, you two. Let's go. yourself ripped apart. You'll get yourself killed if you keep watching me fight. <laughs> Come on. I'm just in awe of the great Flynn Shifo. Sh shut up! Hey, this isn't the time to get worked up. I am not worked up! It's okay. Don't hide it. Would you be serious for once? I am serious. I can't concentrate with you talking all the time. Well, I can't concentrate without talking, so we're kind of stuck. Dragon Sword! <laughs> Dragon Sword! Oh, 
Commandant, you're not too bad either. We're about to the middle. I'm still up for some more fighting. <laughs> you look like you're actually having fun in the middle of all this. <laughs> you do too. Now, Yuri! Right. Take this! Should be okay for now. Th thank you so much. Your Highness. Don't push yourself, okay? Vesperia number one broke, huh? I'm sorry. Yeah, seems like the materials we used to make the body were too brittle. It was our fault. Don't worry, the core's fine, and I can repair it. It's just... What a sad ending. Estelle has saved their lives, but they shouldn't move for a while. I guess we have to stay and defend them for a little more. So why not just make this a fort? It's been a while, Yuri. I've heard stories about brave Vesperia. I guess the mercenaries I hired weren't sufficient. Sorry for the trouble. I'm sure the guilds are in chaos right now, too. Thank you for your help. It won't really make up for things, but I'll help with the defense. You're going to fight? Oh no, I'm a merchant. Just watch. Witcher! Is something wrong? Yes. That tower near Ospio has created an unusual formula around itself. Judging by the crests, it's absorbing some kind of power. In addition, all residents throughout Elikia have reported feeling strange. Absorbing? Feeling strange? Is it absorbing human life? Duke. Life is very pure mana. Does he intend to use it to attack? This is what he meant by exchanging all human life to destroy the Atafagos. The formula is expanding in stages. At this rate, 
It could affect the entire world. No! We can't just stand around. But the spirit's power alone won't be enough. Even if we repair Vesperia number one, that alone won't be enough. What? But it took out all those monsters! Judging by the size of the Autophagos, we'd need several hundred times the power. Several hundred? That's gonna be tough. Facing this calamity is going to take an insane amount of power. I guess we have no choice but to change the cores to spirits. Wait! Could you explain what you're talking about? Oh yeah, we meant to talk to you all about it. Hey Flynn, we want to tell Yoder and the guilds too. Can you call them here? <laughs> oh Yuri, you seriously want him to call the Emperor to a place like this? You never change. I could say the same for you, Yuri. What? <laughs> okay, I'll see what I can do. In exchange, you all go talk to the people of the Union in Palastrale. Okay. So I guess we're off to Dongress to Nordopolica? Yeah. Mind giving us a ride? <laughs>